Hello, it's me, Nigel Barden, and we're going to be talking about Ghana's pickled onion pots with sausage and mash. Mm -hmm. Very straightforward. Now, mash, do it any way you like. You can do it with butter and milk. You can do it with oil and milk, whatever you wish. There's no doubt butter does give it a really luxurious feel. It smells good. It tastes fantastic. And it's one ingredient that chefs said that they would not do without. So, butter is the way forward, I think. A dollop of that, a warm mash goes into your ramekin and then it's really a matter of just assembling. So I'm gonna go for some of my beef and garlic sausage. You can either buy them cooked or pre-cook them yourself and let them cool down. And then of course, it's a Ghana's shallot. I love these, they're really, oh. But it's Arabian Nights, so there's a little bit of chili in there, there's some cinnamon, there's coriander. It's pickled onion, but, and some more. Uh, and then I'm just gonna garnish them with a little bit of parsley. There you have it, Ghana's pickled onion pots with sausage and mash, easy peasy.